G'day, let's play some more Danish Common Sense, where we are trying to get down the coast here towards England. The goal is going to be take Calais so that we can fabricate across here. Now we have got an alliance with France at the moment. Hopefully he can pay off his debt quickly enough to join a war against Flanders, who is not in the HRE, and he's only allied with Burgundy, so it could be a good one. Burgundy is probably pretty strong. They are in two parts. England rivaled us, which is fine, I guess. Berry will become part of Burgundy, no doubt. I guess they'd be laughing that um, England forced France to release Berry. Hopefully Provence will attack France at some point as well. Alright, got our claim on Antwerp. So, when he comes back, we can see what the situation actually is. If we declare on them, Burgundy would come in, Gelray would come in. Good. We need France. Have a truce with Flanders. Uh, that could actually be an issue. It's probably going to be the same time as the Burgundian truce. Destabilise France. Uh, massively in debt. The debt isn't too much of an issue. If they didn't have that truce, they might actually do it. Alright, well, Poland. Distant war is going to be too much of an issue. Lithuania, even worse. So we would need another ally in this area. We're willing to attack Flanders. But let's fabricate on... Oh, Ghent. Doesn't matter, so let's just do Ghent. Best chance of being found in Flanders, so let's go there. Hmm. And we need to actually wait for a number of reasons anyway. We need to wait for manpower to come back up. So that Sweden don't decide to declare war on us. And we need to wait for... Damn it. Aggressive expansion to tick down. Because it is close in a lot of places. So if we keep expanding in this area, that's going to be terrible. The stronger we can get compared to Sweden, the better. Hey, cool. Does that mean that they've stopped supporting? Where does it say? Actually, it should say in here, shouldn't it? Yeah, everybody stopped supporting his independence. Really? So, if historical rivals would go away, that'd be good idea. In the meantime, we need to end the Royal Marriage with France, which we can't do yet. We're not going to, actually. No, good. We're not going to be doing that. So let's push through, try and get to the next idea group, which will probably be a military one. Not sure yet. National decisions. Tax up. Sounds good. We won't form Scandinavia at any point. Take a look at our chances here. Minus 10%. And... Can't find out to 98. That's so stupid. Got a claim on Ursul. Let's grab a claim. Let Garland and Goldingen probably the only ones left. Yep. Alright, Goldingen. Can't believe... Poland haven't even attacked the Teutonic Order. Maybe they did, and I don't remember. But they didn't take any land, is the point. Haven't even integrated them in Soviet yet. Alright, so if we attack them, Lithuania would defend them. They're defensive, but they're actually still close. So as long as we can keep building up trust... Remember to do that to all the people in all the places. Hey, Gelray. We've already given you access. France, we have not. Let's build trust with them. Won't ask for access though, because it's something I always forget to get rid of later. Alright, and... What was your war goal? Bookermark. Well, that's good. You have claims on them both though, so he's going to full annex him. What's the chance that we could get in this war at all? Hess would still join. Unhalt. Ah, uh, not there. They're a little guy somewhere, aren't they? Oh, down there. Alright, no, let's not bother. 
Lundberg. S and Randberg one. Randberg's in debt. Alright. England only take Ulster. Why did you not take more? Small enough. Alright, the ruler of the planet has died without relieving direct air. They will join a union with France unless we contest it. If we contest it, we will create a succession war over the planet. God damn, it's unfortunate it went the other way. It went that way. France have 19 troops. I doubt we'd be able to call Poland in. Gelray, maybe. I definitely want to give it a go though. Although it is the Platinum, so they'll have their troops as well. Well, it is only the Platinum. It wouldn't give us a union over France or anything. But having a guy in the HRE who we control, he's nice and small. God, I don't know. Let's just do it. It's so rare you get that chance. Denmark claims the old king was not of sound mind. So why did they choose France anyway? More development. 267 versus our 263. If we had one more province, it would have automatically gone to us. Lithuania. Absolutely. Come and kill them. So it is technically an aggressive war. What do we need to do? Take capital Heidelberg. We can totally do that. They brought in... How would they bring in Hungary? Pricks. Alright. And Aachen. Let's do a run down to Oberfolz. We can't get access anywhere. Which means France can't either. If we get to Aachen first. Through Brabant. At war with neighbouring ally, which would be. Where's your ally? Arkin. Damn it. Alright, so you can't do that one. Let's work our way down here. And go through Trier. Alright, Gelray, please join in. Flame on Flanders. So, yeah, let's actually keep getting ready for that war. Fabricate on Ghent. Probably get caught. But as long as these guys don't go over 50, I'm happy with that. Alright, Trier. Ask for access. Yep. Head over to Arkin. That also gets us, actually, gets us straight to the war goal. Well, what should we do? I think we should go this way and hope that Gilray can come up here. Sweden aren't going to help at all. Norway should come down at some point. See if we can get. I doubt they'd have access, but see if we can get them down there. Actually, going to do a run past and see if we could get there. Oh, we can. Run, 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 run. Yep, sorry, buddy. France is there. I definitely want to grab this though. Hamburg is under attack. Who the hell is up there? Aachen. That's fine. Grab a free four. Sorry, go Ray. Valiant effort. But we'll grab this and then we'll run back and finish off France. Worked out really freaking well, that. So, can we stop France going through there? We can. So he's asked for access through Cologne by the looks. 
Where's he gone? Yep, three flying. Where you didn't get access? No. It's fine then. Actually, if I have a chance of killing them, that'd be even better. Go on an Eric. Kill Louis. Look at that, nine to a three. Got him. Alright. Now head straight for the war goal. Palatinate had an army there. It's still there. Good. I don't know where the French army was just retreating to. Claim on Goldingen. Alright, let's claim the last one for Lekalen. Shouldn't get caught over there. It would really be a good idea to actually expand out here properly, as long as we don't get bored with Lithuania. That would be a great chunk of land to have. And did we end up... Didn't get the alliance with them. Because of Lithuania, that's right. Alright. It's not looking particularly healthy, but we are sitting on the war goal, so it's going well. Recall from there. Um, Trier. <clears throat> Let's cancel that access. Save our points. We should be able to get access through there somewhere anyway now. France would have asked for plenty. France got access through Burgundy somewhere. Not through Clev. It's got it through Bourbon. Alright. Lubeck by Hungary. Well, we might be able to take a war goal first. Although we do need a lot of war score for this. What are we looking for? The union with the planet. It's only 60%. But, yeah, that'll take some doing. Four forts in France. Three forts in France. Okay. <clears throat> well, the sooner we get the war goal, the better. And France is the war leader, so if we go take Paris, assuming that's still the capital, which it is. Then losing both of our forts, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not paying for the fleet. We have some guys we need to worry about. Make sure there's no stupid mistakes. Poland. Hey, buddy. Come in. Yes. Awesome. That'll tip it in our favour. Nice. And free diplomats. Um, one siege of Heidelberg. Kill these guys. Then. Fame on Ghent. Alright, finish claiming everything there. No manpower whatsoever. Hopefully France haven't had a chance to recover theirs after their Burgundian and English defeats. What's going on down there? Alright, we've got Fultz. It's up to 14%. Definitely want to take Paris. Great that it's still so early in the game. Where's their total? 267. Hmm. Need 9, have 15, we'll be fine sitting here. Hopefully Palatinate doesn't have an army anywhere that's going to try and go home. It doesn't. So Aachen and Hungary. Oh, that's looking bad. What are you guys doing? Alright, if we get Hungary out soon, that would work for us. White piece them. They're definitely going to take this before we can get down, or before these guys can take anything. Hopefully they don't transfer it. That's occupied by Hungary, so we might get lucky with this Aachen. Well, they shouldn't actually be able to transfer it to France at all, should they? Unless France take a province up there themselves. Their army is in Poland. Coming down to actually do some nasty stuff down there. Okay. 
we can have three diplomats for a while. Poland are happy, Lithuania is happy. Let's prove with England on the off chance that something will go well there. He's rivaled to Provence, us, Burgundy. Burgundy were willing to be an ally before, so let's improve with them. Yeah, there goes Hamburg, which was Arken. They have not transferred it. Galway are going to try and take it back. Good on you, Galway. Stand right next to the giant army that wants to kill you. Alright, lost them both. So, the main issue with that is going to be the occupied home provinces will be horrific. But they can't get to our capital at least. And if we take the French capital... Novgorod will cede stuff to the Livonians. Anything we can fabricate on? No. Pomerania is yeah, full annexed. Well, that would happen. So they should have massive unrest up here. Apparently, Hess is too afraid to tell him to give it back. <clears throat> Truce with Lundberg has ended. He's allied with Brandenburg and Brunswick. If we were stupid enough to do this right now, Hess couldn't join, Brandenburg couldn't join. Brunswick are uh, two provinces. It would have been a great time for that. Well, except for the aggressive expansion. Which we have to let tick down. And Italy's going to leave the HRA soon. So, in one of the... Um, there was a Hessian practice I was doing. Had uh, three electors down here. It was like Savoy, Milan, and Florence were all electors. I was hoping that would prevent them from leaving in 1490, but it didn't work. They do actually have to be vassals to stay in. Where's the French army on? They give up and turn around. Hmm. Well, we're happy with these guys keeping Hungary busy. Although the sooner they piece them out, the better. What is his <clears throat> total? Massive. Alright, now that you've got somebody sitting on your capital, let's just grab war apps. When you agree to that, you can be out. And hopefully he hasn't transferred anything have a look. Hungry, hungry, hungry. That's the fourth that matters. Hungry, good. Harken, perfect. Sorry there, Gilroy. Take this fort, should be enough. And the Vonians have rivaled us. And now they're supporting Sweden again. Which means Sweden instantly goes up to 100%. Fine. Alright, got the fort, piece them out. And extra bit of money, a little inflation. No, don't want to deal with inflation. So we can't grab anything. We can tell them to release someone. At least Bosnia. All right, another treaty is with people that we're going to attack soon. Which is not Trier, or Savoy, or Genoa. I guess just another with France. We'll grab the prestige for telling him to do it. And we'll get all our land back. We'll immediately cut this from 0.26 and there goes Paris, cool. Well, let's head over to Arkham. Alright, yep, half the uh, war exhaustion from the provinces. Good. Alright, let's take a quick look to see if we can get what we want. Not quite yet. When we take that, we should be able to. If we get, yeah, we'll take Ark and get our fort back, and that'll be it. So I wasn't going to mess with the HRE, but if we're going to have a PU over the guy, then yeah, we'll go for it. Don't think we can inherit his electorship 
when we're not in the HRE though, unfortunately. Which is Saxony. Raw exhaustion is high, yes. Damn it. Rush stock. We're at 12, so that'll happen no matter what. Rush stock is over there. Hmm. Well, we might be okay. If you could go over there and stand in Rostock and siege that down, that'd be great. Uh, Norway do keep trying. He's going to Rostock. No, he's going past. We probably have no access through. No, we do. The Poland should come up. Just tell them I need to be over here. And Lithuania, you need to be over there too, just in case you didn't realise. Battle of Aachen. I didn't know there would be a battle there. Okay. We should take it before France can take that, so that's fine. Muscovy have rivaled us. Oh, awesome. Alright, there goes Aachen. So, that is going to disappear. Puts us on 69. Do we just want a piece straight up. Could do it. I think I'd rather grab stuff from Arkham though. War reps to be specific. And null all his treaties. Could do with some prestige. Although I'm sure we're going to grab a bunch for getting the PU. Now money is yeah, not worth it. Send that. Flagged, get to Rostock and France. Alright, let's check this. Denmark and the Platinum will form a union with Christian I von Wittelsbach becoming king over both nations. We gain 10 prestige, that's no, not too bad. No? Aggressive expansion is luckily ticked down far enough. France lose prestige and nothing much else happens. But if we could grab some war reps from France that would be great money where's inflation 13 ducats to 0.02 sounds pretty fair it's nearly the end of the month and the French army is about to die so we can actually wait a bit on that Pretty lucky with these rebels too. 11% chance. We're actually going to get over there in time. Alright, our allies lost, which means we can hopefully really quickly kill them. Ugh, more damage than I wanted to take, but destroying that army, definitely good. If these guys would like to actually fire now. Juice sort on me because we're at war and we couldn't anyway. Alright, Diplo Rep. Awesome. And no hurry to. What? We lost. What the hell are you talking about? How are they not there? Oh, that was. The sh I think it was the French army. Sure, it was the French army. They must have arrived. I don't know. Whatever. Fire. Damn it. Alright, well, he's gone, so we can't get help with that rebellion anymore. But, we shall piece them out. Grab all his money, apparently. And check through this again. So, we're taking... War reps and money. We get the PU, we get his money, and other stuff happens. We annul his treaty with. Who are we about to attack? Flanders, he doesn't have one. Alright, let's just do that. So, we now have our 
guy in here who thinks he wants to vote for France, but no. Immediately improve relations with him and we will have one vote. All right. Awesome. So thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you click like or subscribe, that would be fantastic. And I hope to see you again soon. See you later.